What is up guys, it's Taki on Cosplay here, so I've just been back, um, I'm finally home now, um, if you're wondering where I was at, uh, just a fresh reminder, uh, I was at um, was it Newcastle from SunnyCon weekend, um, it was brilliant, I really enjoyed it, it was so so much fun, um, but I'm exhausted from travels and all that stuff that happened, so bear with me and my voice, so uh, basically I, what happened was, uh, I think it was Saturday, uh, I was at the after party night, which is hilarious. Um, I was at the the same place of the location for the after party night uh, from like last year, and my voice was killing me from that after that day. And those, so I'm still trying to recover. Um, but it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it on that night. Um, also, that the con itself, uh, it was nice to be back, and I got to see a lot of people. It was great, and uh, like, even new people as well along the way. I I, I want to give a shout out to to the new people that I met and who watched my videos and stuff, I want to say thank you so much at the bottom of my heart. It really means a lot. Uh, I just do this for fun, I mean, so I just do this for fun, share my experience of the, the cons of I go to, the journey, and all the fun stuff for the, for the you know, and my, my own fun stuff videos of fun content, you know, just randomly, you know what I mean? So, um, but I appreciate it, really, really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Um, also that, like the cosplays I've done uh, turned out really well. Uh, <laughs> there was a little bit of malfunction uh, one or two days of the the cosplays I was wearing, but it kept going. Uh, survived all the way through it until right in the end of the con. Uh, I knew it was about to fall apart. I was like, ah, I knew. It. I was very very lucky. So Friday I was wearing uh, Caesar from uh, Pokemon. It was all Pokemon actually for the weekend. So I was wearing Caesar for Friday. Saturday I was wearing Tentacruel. And then Sunday I was wearing Swampert, so that was really really fun. Um, I really enjoyed it. It was so much good laugh with it. Uh, I I think out of all of those three new cosplays I've uh, I've worn from last weekend, uh, I would say the most one I got uh, a, lo a lot of people really liked it was uh, Tentacruel. So that was a lot of fun. Um, it was so funny that I made it, and uh, for sure, and uh, I'll probably end up wearing that again and the other two as well in the future. So it just needs to be re, re I'm gonna probably remake it and then revamp it like a couple of updates into it of the costume. So it's not that I guess it's not that bad, especially Teddy Crow. So I can actually really fix that easily. So yeah, and also that I've got, I bought some stuff by the way. I want to show you something a little bit of my haul of this for this video today. So I can't wait to show you. So this is I got the I was I got the like uh, the ticket of like the premium. So. Uh, or VIP, but I got the pre premium one, so I got, I got like getting the uh, early access, so which is really really cool. So this is the the bag of it of the SunnyCon twenty twenty four. So it looks really really cool. I like this the the cover of it of this, uh, the the you know, the the mascot of it you know, to show like the this year of uh, for twenty twenty four of it. So because they every year on SunnyCon they always change change things up with the the logo and the the theme as well. So. And a different mascot as well, so which is really cool. Um, so I like I like this one. So twenty twenty four is really really cool for that one. So, so yeah, I bought I bought a few things and uh, I got uh, a gift. I got a gift as well from someone. So, well, I need to show you actually that I, that I got actually. Um, there's a few bits and pieces. I'm trying to remember. So I need to slowly. I need to slowly be careful because this is the frame by the way. So, um, here we go. So this is the biggest frame. So this is the the frame of the Pokemon. Uh, it was a type. It was a type illusion from the Legend Arceus one. So I never played the game before, but I hope I'll be able to play that game at some point. So, but please don't be mad at me because I, I still need to play that game. So I've seen the game, but I never got. I never owned it yet. You know what I mean? Or I get a chance to buy it, I'll, I'll play it in that. So I will at some point. Yeah, as I was saying. Um, I got this as a gift, and I, I want to give a shout out to my uh, two of my friends, uh, Stephen and uh, <laughs> Steve. I can't, I can't even speak because of because of the way I saw this. It's just oh, I was blown away. So yeah, Stephen and Helen, um, a, a shout out to them for the, for getting me you know, making this for me as a gift. It means a lot. I know I ha it's not my first time I got like something like this. Uh, I got like the the Magma Zone one. And then now I got this is my second one. <laughs> I appreciate for you them doing that for me, or well, making this for me. Um, now I need to figure out how to make some space for it. You know what I mean, so I still got it. The other one, um, it, it's, it's all like wrapped up and sealed up, like you know, keeping condition. 
So I'll probably do the same thing for this one. So I will find a, a frame. I will find uh, a space for it. You know, put it up on the wall or such. I mean, so and then I really appreciate it though. Uh, to shouts to uh, shouts to um, Stephen and uh, Helen for that. So I really really appreciate it. And I just I didn't expect that. I mean, but I really appreciate it for you guys doing that for me. I mean, it means a lot because they, they know that I've uh, I've cosplayed Thai Illusion before, so which is really fun. So, but yeah, I'll remember this memory. I'll shout out to them. Thank you so much. And also, oh yeah, if you wonder what these are bottoms, what these bottoms are, uh, there are the coins of yen from Japan. So, because I went to Japan a couple of months ago this year, and um, they basically made a frame with all the different coins of uh, the different coins of yen from a uh, japan one so it just brings me back memories actually so i'm just it makes me want to go back it makes me want to spend my money again in japan all the shops that, that i love like good anime shops and card game shops so a shout to them thank you so much now i'm going to re repay you back off getting you something back it used to i mean so oh well, now we're going to try and make things even <laughs> so i think i think it's like 2-1 I think the score, uh, so two one to them. I would, I would say so. I shout out to them. I mean, but the lovely guys. I mean, so I shout out to them. So, so yeah. Next one is I got a plushie. Uh, it's a uh, butterfree. This really really cute butterfree. I really like this one. Um, I I had to pick this up uh, because I, I feel I want to pick this up because uh, I was at I was I was at the stall. I got to see two of my friends, uh, Gilbert and Emma. Uh, they were running their own stall of like uh, like they had like a lot of like Pokemon stuff and some Yu-Gi-Oh stuff like you know mixed with other things you know so and then um, I noticed like there's a couple of ones that are from the Pokemon Center as well so I saw there was quite a few there are there a couple of ones I really want I and mean, then I missed it, a few of them that I should have bought it but I next day I was gonna about to get it but they, all, they were gone so that was my fault because <laughs> so uh, because uh, moments ago I saw. Uh, the first day I saw uh, Friday, I saw uh, Sphiel, uh, evolves to Warring, oh, Silly on Warring one, the, the evolution of that. Uh, I like the wee, you know, Seal one, the Pokemon, so I was good about to get it and when I first saw it, and then it makes me want to buy it, I was going to get it later. And then next day, uh, I noticed I was gone, so I was kind of regret. So, things happened, I mean, so I am still mad, but I should have bought it, because I was very unsure of myself, but when they... When they put up, uh, when they stocked up the new couple of new ones, uh, they put Butterfree up. So I was like, oh, that's really nice. Actually, it's my first time seeing Butterfree. I mean, so it's really cute. And uh, I saw like loads of Caterpies and Metapods before, but not Butterfree. So because I've seen it on videos, so but seeing it in person, it looks really nice actually. So I might, I might as well uh, pick it up and buy it. I mean, so because it's really cute. I mean, so so yeah, I'm happy with this one. I mean, so this Butterfree needs. Uh, when I saw it at the convention, I was like, you know what, I may as well buy Butterfree. It needs, it needs a new home. So, so I'm, hopefully I'll look after it. I mean, so, well, you know, to make sure that it's okay. So, a wee bit of dirt there. So, yeah. So, it's from, uh, it, it's, the brand of that is from Pokemon Center. So, so the same, uh, but this is still the same, the product of the, was it Pokemon Fit? So, it's still the same. So, so I'm happy with that one. And then, oh yeah, I've got a wristband of the, of the SunnyCon weekend, so this is what it looks like. The color they have all different colors depending on what uh, what ticket you buy as well. So I since I got the premium one, so this is the this color. Uh, I heard the VIP was like the yellow one, I think, and uh, all the other um, tickets, um, you know, the different ones like day tickets, weekends ones. They have they have all different colors. The ones who have uh, be at uh, artist alley staffs and stuff like they all have different colors as well, I believe. So yeah, that's really cool. So I quite like it. So that's going to go in my, you know, treasure box of all the memories of the cons that I've been to for the past 11 years. I mean, so uh, I've got loads and loads of stuff, actually. Bear with me, guys. Um, oh, yeah. I bought um, is, uh, uh, when I was picking up the the goodie bag uh, of after well, where I showed up my premium ticket. So I got the goodie bag and uh, the T-shirt. I will show you the T-shirt in two seconds, actually. Next door, next to the table, they have all the bits and pieces or accessories for the SunnyCon. So I, there was like a lucky charm and a, a good health. So I went for there's two different ones. So like I, I went for like the uh, good lucky. This is the good luck, uh, good luck charm. So I, ha I had to buy this one though. So uh, I wanted, I wanted to like um, the other one, the good health, but um, I should have bought it. But it's because I was so undecided. I mean, so but um, I, at least I bought the. 
the the good luck. This is the definitely good luck one. So I'm I'm definitely gonna I'll probably use this to go anywhere where I go. So because and I, this is like a, they kind of did a, like a Japanese theme of this one, like the good luck charms, good health, and all the other ones. So so I'm happy I got this one though. So it, it looks cute the, the the design. So I'm quite happy with that one. So and then also the oh yeah the glow sticks. I bought the oh yeah oh, check out these glow sticks. It's so cool. <laughs> If you wonder where I got these, uh, they're, they're the same table as well, so I thought, oh, and I bought the Lucky Charm one, so they were using it for, like, the after party nights. They, they're not just yellow, the glow sticks, they have, like, other colours as well, so I bought two yellow glow sticks because I use that for, like, the after party when I was cosplay as uh, Host Club uh, Denki, so you'll probably see that on the video uh, coming soon of my video vlog of that, the after party night. So, yeah, it was really cool. Uh, I really enjoyed it. It was just such a good laugh, but, yeah. I bought these ones so cheap uh, randomly, so uh, they cost about seven pound each. And uh, any two, uh, if you bought, but if you buy two, they cost about ten pound. That's what it's, that's what's the offer. So at least I bought two of those. I mean, you might as well. So it was a good deal actually. So and uh, the t-shirt, I gotta show you actually. So I probably will wear this actually. This t-shirt is really cool actually, because I saw a few of my mates wore it actually, and then a few people wore it as soon as they got the the t-shirts along with it with their tickets. So the ones with the VIP and the premium ones. So, so this the this is what it looks like the T-shirt. So the T-shirt looks really cool. I'm definitely going to wear that for sure. So, um, it looks fantastic the the design as well. So, but I'm just checking out the logo as well. So, but yeah, it looks cool. I mean, so it's it's definitely like a really cool T-shirt. So if you're interested in getting like T-shirts and stuff, um, or how to get them, uh, I think you need to buy the. I think the premium ticket and the VIP in order to get the free t-shirts. I don't know if they sell t-shirts individually. I could be wrong. So, you know, like separately. I'm not too sure. So, yeah, I'm happy with that. So, the t-shirt was cool. I mean, so. And, uh, what else I've got, actually? I've got a couple of things. Oh, yeah. Let's see. I've got these rubber straps. Uh, shout outs to Jamie. Uh, his stall. So, I saw, like, a wee box of, like, all the like, sale ones or, like, cheap ones or something like that. So I saw like you know, Final Fantasy rubber straps. So this is these two characters here I picked up. So it's, it was in the box. I may as well it would cost two pounds each. So I may as well pick them up because I do collect these by the way. So I know that I know some of them are like discontinued now. So they're not as like um, you know or, like there's not as many out there that, on sale out there or they sell these kind of stuff. So. Um, it just depends, you know what I mean? But I'm quite happy that I bought them anyway, so I need them for my collection, so... But, it was cool, I mean, I'm quite happy with them, so... And then, other ones, I bought, like, stickers and all that such as well along the way, because I, I'm into stickers, by the way, I really am, you know what I mean? I'm into, like, like, clicking stickers and put it on, like, like binders and folders and stuff, so... Um, I bought this sticker here, so... That one's really cool. I don't know if you will recognize it. I kept forgetting where this movie's from. I mean, because uh, I, I watched that movie before and then I ended up forgetting it. So it look, that one looks really cool. The sticker looks really, really cool and cute as well. So if you're wondering um, which artist alley it was, I don't know if you will see it actually. It's, it's like that. So I don't know if you can see it properly or the name and such because it's stamped. I, I should have bought, I should have um, picked up with a business card. I forgot to actually pick it up. So she was cosplaying as a. Uh, uh, she was definitely cosplaying on one of the days on Saturday. Uh, she was cosplaying as, um, was it, uh, Hatsumi Miku, a crossover with uh, Team Rocket, which is really cool, actually, from Pokemon. So that was really, really, really cool. And uh, I was cosplaying Tentacruel that, that day as well. We got photos together. It was, it was so, such a cool moment. So I, I give a shout out to her, man, for doing that, man. That was, that was awesome. That when she cosplayed that, that we crossover idea. I never thought of that, but that was a good one. <laughs> that was a good one. So, and then next one I bought, yeah, I like I like collecting badges as well, by the way. So, for, like, putting them, like, uh, for my bags and stuff, I mean, just for fun, I mean. So, so I collect badges, so just these ones there. So, this one's uh, 2B, so I can't remember which artist alley I was at last time. So, but, yeah, this this 2B one, uh, I had to pick this up because it looks cute. It was just sitting right in front of me uh, when I was looking at one of her stalls. Um, like her artist alley, is though, and um, 
I get told that I'm always the last one, so I was the lucky jackpot actually when I got this. Actually, I don't know why I'm getting the lucky ones here, like the last ones. I don't know, it's just a weird one though, but I'm happy I got it anyway, so it's definitely going to go in my bag. So I'm happy with that one, so I'm definitely happy. Um, the next one I got is uh, I got more stickers, I believe. I'm just trying to remember. Oh, oh no, badges as well, included as well, and stickers. Um, oh crap, sorry, I'm trying. There's so much stuff. Uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'm trying to try and make sure I've got everything that I've got. So, yeah. The stickers will be in a second. Because oh, that's something I want to show. But, yeah. Uh, the one I purchased is... Uh, let's see. I'm trying to remember what I purchased, actually. So, I've got business cards anyway. So, I've got this one here. I've got business cards I collected. So, just is that one. I don't know if you can see it properly. The socials as well. So they have Instagram and all that, so and other socials, so you can try and follow that. And I've got this one as well. It's quite small. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see that. It's. I think this this one there is uh, I got the badge of uh, Mario and Luigi from Super Mario. So I got that one. That was really cool. I think it comes with this one though, I believe. So, yeah. So I got that because I had to get that badge because it looks cute. And uh, I, I was at, uh, oh yeah, the stickers, stickers. Uh, I was at my one of my friends' uh, stall. Um, he had like, he still have like plenty, plenty of like Yu-Gi-Oh stickers and the uh, Sonic stickers ran randomly for a laugh. So I bought these two, uh, these funny ones, uh, Dark Magician and Dark Magician Girl. I had when I saw those, I was like, I want that for a laugh actually. Cause <laughs> I love these kind of funny stickers of Yu-Gi-Oh, whatever and such. But th these ones, holy days, I had to pick those up. I mean, so I always shout out to them. So shout out to him. For that, and I was shouting to my friend for like these funny stickers. <laughs> you know who you are, by the way. <laughs> and uh, another sticker as well. I've got the baby Yugi as well. So, because I, I do rec I can't remember the, which stall it was, but I do remember I recognize them. So, I, ha I had to buy this. I mean, so so cute as well. So, I'm definitely going to use that. This is this is definitely a baby Yugi, by the way. So, <laughs> just to give it, just to let you guys know. So, and uh let's see what else oh yeah i've got this as well baby i got this as a gift uh, one of my uh, shouts to my friend for giving me this as well baby if you you know who you are <laughs> i still got this i can't believe i still have this <laughs> oh man because i was going through my bag like i said i would just try to go through my bag of all the uh, stuff some stuff that i bought actually from this bag so um oh yeah i got a uh, what's it called a uh, Yu-Gi-Oh stickers a uh, shout out to lisa as well for her, her artist alley, so a wee shout out to her. So I had to get this, I mean, because I love Yu Gi Oh as well. So that's that's her socials. You can go and follow her, by the way. That's just, she has all like uh, Facebook, Instagram, and all that. So go and check her out. So her her, her drawings and all, all, like, all the stuff she does and that, uh, her own drawings and stuff like that. Um, it's really cool. I mean, I saw the ones with the Yu Gi one and the My Hero Academia one. It looks really cool. Um, if you're really curious and want to see more of it, highly go and follow her. Um, she does like quite a lot of good good ones. Um, if you're interested and want to buy her stuff. And uh, what else? Oh yeah, I've got uh, this picture actually. Um, I've got a picture. I was with my friend Jane. Uh, that I was at the the after party for SunnyCon actually on Friday. No Sunday. No, not Sunday. Uh, Saturday night. Saturday night. So this is what it looks like. This is so cool, actually. So I can't zoom it like that because, like, due to I don't know, lose its focus. I don't know. So I'm just going to show you like that. So, so this is what it looks like. So, <laughs> so it looks so cool. I mean, so that was such a cool night. I mean, so I'm definitely going to remember that. It's such a cool night. I really enjoyed it. I mean, so it was a, such a funny, funny night. And then also, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, that's that's the one. That, that's the business card of that. Uh, to shout out to Emma and Gilbert. I don't know if you can see it. That's a shout out. There's the business card. That's how I bought this one. So this is how I bought this one. There's that's the business card here. Go and for go and check them out. I mean, so they have a lot of good, a lot of really good stuff actually. Uh, let's see what else. Oh yeah, we've got a couple of different fan arcs as well, and then uh, a couple more business cards as well. So yeah, a couple more business cards. I'm gonna show you them anyway. So we got this one as well. So real random. That's a, Fair enough, I, mean, I think that's because it's with uh, this one, I believe. 
So I think that's that one. I think it's come along with this one. I could be wrong, so bear with me. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong with this. So because I think one of, uh, I think um, one of the artists that I think was uh, currently ill, I think I believe, and I couldn't make it or something. And uh, there was there was a replacement of the the people for for the, working for the artist alley. So um, so shout outs to the person you know, for the speed recovery by the way. So and also here's I right, here's the the fan art that I got on the show. So. So I will show you actually I've got a couple of really good ones actually. I just want to make sure I've got the right ones. So I've got this one from Neo Automino series. So I when I first saw this one, I actually really like this one though, so I had to pick this up actually. So I don't I don't know if that's new. I could be wrong unless it has been out for a while, but this one look this design looks amazing. So I, I bought that, had to. So that's this one comes along with with this one. So that's that's the the, the stall that I was at, the, the, to go and check. if you want to see more of the uh, other ones, so uh, like not just this one, but if you want to see other ones, go and follow this by the way. So uh, it's on it it's on the Instagram and all that and all the socials, so you can purchase it. You know what I mean, so you can check out the, their stuff. So I uh, wish out. You know what I mean, so there you go. It looks amazing actually. I had, I had to buy it. I had to. I had to. And then I've got the other uh, arts as well. I've got uh, is a uh, Marine G. Uh, was it Mar my dress up, darling, of a uh, Marine Kuchigawa? So I think this one's really cool. I had to get this one though, so because I, I love that uh, the, that anime series. So look, uh, the design of it looks cool. So I'm trying to remember all the, the arts that I seen and then I bought as well. So I should have picked up the business card. I should have, man. I mean, because it's like i should have because I, I didn't think about it that time i mean because i was so busy so that weekend but yeah i'm quite happy i got this one though so it looks cute so and oh yeah i've got this um <clears throat> i've got this picture here shout out to my friend actually i mean she gave me this for free actually definitely gonna probably keep this uh, in the folder you know, with all the collections of like all the the fan arcs and stuff so yeah we shout out to my friend you know who you are by the way thank you so much for giving this for free it looks fantastic i like the drawing it looks so so cool i like the the characters as well the the way you you, you made like you drew them so but yeah it looks cool i mean we shout out uh, shout out to my friend as well do you know who you are by the way <laughs> if you're watching this so and then also the i've got two more different fan arcs as well i believe so i'm just checking them good i'm just making sure i've got everything yeah 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 i think so i think there's two or oh, two or three i think oops i dropped the business card so so there is the dark magician girl so there's that one there so that's a really cool fan art i had to get this one so i think that comes along with this business card so so go and uh, go and check out it's fantastic i think i bought a uh, dark magician girl keychain out uh, uh, to that person i bought it with, oh, to, uh, from the last time i saw that stall i mean so i do remember that so like so and then when i saw this one uh, you know up on on the, the the display on there when i was at the con so i had, I had to pick this and i mean so it's really cute this uh this fan art design of the the draw of like the dark magician girl it looks really fantastic so you guys know that i love you girl by the way so uh I, i'm definitely gonna keep this it looks so cute i just love the the drawing of it the design itself so i've got a couple of friends who are big fans of uh, Yu Gi Oh and Dark Magician Girl, so I wish I bought more by right? it. Actually, I wish I bought more. I think I bought this one five pound actually, I believe. So it's not expensive; it's quite cheap actually. So, and then a shout out to my friend Amy uh, for her stall. Oh, I bought this one. It was a Hatsune Miku, so it looks really cool. I had to get this as well. I bought. I bought her. A couple of her art art stuff before, like a uh, Spy X Family and uh, Genshin as well, I believe. So and then I bought this Hamsi Miku as well. It looks really cool actually. So uh, I I've never seen this one before. I, I, I had to pick this up because like I do I do like Vocaloid. I mean so and uh, I I decided to pick this up. I mean so it looks really cool. It looks really cute. So I like it. And then the last one I got is not it's not the one I bought actually. Um, it's it's just a shout out to my friends that I couldn't make it to to the wedding last year and they got me like a small gift as well. I, I got them a gift as well, by the way. So just to say like um like I couldn't make it to the to their wedding. So I just like give them a, a present, you know, just in return. You know, just to you know, like 
even though I couldn't make it, I'd just sign, you know, here's a present. I mean, just, just you know, like, like, um, you know, it's just, uh, it, I, I basically just want to congratulate him, I mean, so it's a shame that I couldn't be in their wedding last year because due to the travels, it was so complicated to get there, I mean, so, so I, I, it's, it's a shame I couldn't make it, so I decided to get on him a gift, so, and then they got me back with this small gift, even though I couldn't be their wedding, but it was nice though to see uh, my, two of my friends, uh, they were get their, their wedding as well, they got married last year, so here's the wee cute. A wee jar as well, so it looks so cute actually. So it's got like a it's some sort of like a Halloween theme. It's some sort of, uh, yeah, it's some sort of like a Halloween theme. It's got like a wee ghost, a mushroom, and a pumpkin. So so there's I don't know if you can see the name of it. So so a shout out to them by the way. So I I wish I I did when I I did see them at the the convention last weekend, and I I did wish them the congratulations on the wedding. So so yeah, it was it was really cool. It was a really cool moment. Uh, when I saw their photos, uh, I wish I was there in person, uh, but I, I got to see them anyway from last week at another con, so we hung out and chat, so it was really cool. Uh, I'll, I'll try and, I will keep them safe, I will keep this safe by the way, so I'll make sure I don't lose it. And then also, the last one I want to share is that I got to meet the two of the voice actors actually, so um, also the two of the voice actors I met was uh, Matt Shipman and uh, the other one, uh, Brittany. Uh, Lord, do you know what I think I can't. Uh, I think I don't know if I'm saying it wrong there from the second name, but yeah, I got to meet the two actors, uh, two voice actors. They were really amazing, by the way. Um, it was just I got to chat with them for a couple of minutes and you know ask them about the. I I I think I asked them the same question before about like oh I I think I asked the same question uh before to every other voice actors. Uh, I said about like um. Uh, when you first saw your own character, well, when you first saw the character design, when you voice before you voiced that character, um, like what what your your thoughts or your reaction of it, or like, you know, what what did you think? You know what I mean, so I got a feedback from them. It was really really good. It was really good hearing from them. You know what I mean, from from their side. You know what I mean, what their thoughts on when they like played the role of the the characters they play from like the anime shows of like, they got the voice. You know what I mean, so it was really cool. I got to hear them. From, from the the two of them so it was really really cool got to speak to them i got photos with them which is really good i i was such a cool moment i mean so it was i really enjoyed it, it was, i had so so much fun um but yeah i got an autograph uh, from matt shipman so there's the i got he because he plays um a, a character from Yu-Gi-Oh! Arc 5 uh was it shay like the one who played raid raptors uh, i i do i do watch all the Yu-Gi-Oh! series so uh, I, I have watched Yu Gi Oh Arc 5 before so and then he voiced that character as well. He also voices um other uh, other anime characters as well from different shows actually. So he, he voices um uh, Skate Infinity as well, one of the main characters. And also he voices my Hero Academia voice characters. Um uh, I think I can one of them from class one uh, B and the other one is um was it uh, was it, oh I'm trying to remember. Uh, Shigami uh, uh high school uh, high school I'm not too sure. Um but yeah, it's the tornado guy, so I, I keep forgetting his name because it's been a while I haven't watched that actually. I need to go rewatch it actually. So he actually uh, did really well voicing every the characters that I know, like the, the show he he watched. So uh, that I, that I watched, I mean, the, there were shows that I've watched some of the animes before, and I recognize the voice of him from the different shows. So it was cool that I got to talk to him and stuff. It was really really cool. And uh, here's the the card I got an autograph sign. So I got this for free, like basically. Uh, for SunnyCon, when you meet a uh, uh, voice actors, you get one autograph sign, any one item for autograph sign for free. But if you're bringing more different, uh, multiple different items and such, I think you get charged extras, well, or more, I think, or something like that. That's like, you know, because if you're planning to sign more, um, you'll get charged for that as well. So, um, I think selfies, I think, uh, I think you need to pay for it as well, I believe. So, or take a picture or whatever and stuff, and you still need to pay for it. So yeah, I I did it for the first time anyway for when I was at um SunnyCon anyway for the first time doing it. So because I I've I've read like I went to different events, um to meet voice actors and paint it and such and all that and I never experienced the one for SunnyCon before that. So that was my first time doing it. So it was at that con. I mean, so it was really cool. I really enjoyed it. So it was interesting, you know, like the uh, the system how they do things and stuff. So for their event. So it was really cool. I got to speak to them both, and um, it was such a cool moment. I got other photos with them. So yeah, like I said, uh, I, I met the, uh, there's an autograph sign of uh, Matt Shipman's uh, signature as, as well. So his 
his name down there and um he wrote shay as well the name of the character and then he wrote my name on it as well so it's really really cool uh i only got one card signed anyway so if i ever see him again in the future i'm definitely going to get him all the other cards in the back here i'm going to get him sign all the other ones as well if i ever see him in the future in the uk so it depends which events he, uh, they, they go to so i don't know it's, it was really cool you know what i mean so I, i'm i'm quite happy i got to meet them both it's a shame that i didn't get it's a shame that i didn't pay or uh, didn't buy the uh autographs uh, for when i met with uh, britney so um but it was cool i mean i, I really enjoyed it and i mean you know get us you know get to meet them in person and have a chat and then i got a photos one both of them definite so i'm that's a highlight moment i'll never forget so but yeah that's all the stuff that i've got guys um it's been a long long trip from sunny Con. i'm still exhausted i mean from that uh, and the travels and uh, the party night and stuff it's just and the convention itself you know what i mean so it's just so so busy um i've been busy quite a lot with like doing uh video vlogs uh, i did i think i did some video vlogs i mean i'm not too sure so because i can't i'm trying to remember everything what happened for last weekend so um so i did uh i'm sure i did video vlogs i, I remember i did cmvs like I, i'm sure i did I do cmvs at that point from that through through those each days so i did do that and then i did a lot of shoots for a lot of people so i want to give a shout out to all my friends and new people who came up to me for like asking for shoots uh, it means a lot uh, it helps me to to, to get more you know, I want to get more ex, uh, experience like getting more you know learn with my new skills and stuff and um you know I want to keep myself going I really enjoy doing photography so it's a lot of fun um keep myself going as well so I, I had so much fun from that weekend like literally so you will see those uh, like videos of my my vlogs and my CMV will coming soon so keep an eye on it you know uh, when it comes so <laughs> so yeah it was so much fun i mean so i really enjoyed it that weekend so but yeah so i don't know what's next uh, if i don't know when i'll be coming up i don't know when i'll be going back to newcastle to sunny con so i don't know when so and it depends what's going on in my life right now so but we'll see we'll see but anyway guys thank you so much for watching this video i know it's been late and uh, i just want to share this to you guys anyway so all for my my whole stuff so anyways i'm going to take a break i'm going to start sorting out all my photos and videos and stuff if i don't see you i hope i'll see you in uh, some point in other videos as well so anyway guys i'll see you guys next time so see yous <laughs>